Good morning everyone and welcome to another Iceland vlog. We are off on another adventure. We're just packing up our things, putting them in the car. Ooh, it's bright. So today we are actually gonna go on a wonderful hike. We are gonna go to the Skokafoss waterfall. We're gonna go on a hike along the river and up to the mountains. And apparently it is one of the most beautiful hikes here in Southern Iceland. So very excited for this, let's go. I'm gonna miss this view so much. Look at this beautiful mountains. So guys, the Skogafoss waterfall is 62 meters high. And what is really interesting is that all of this actually used to be ancient seaside cliffs. So there, the ocean came up to here and all of this changed, of course, now, obviously, otherwise we wouldn't be standing here. But it's crazy to think that once all of this was seafloor. We are walking up 527 steps <laughs> and um, apparently you get a nice view from the waterfall from up above and up there is also where the trail starts apparently up there it's about seven degrees colder than down here and the wind is quite icy right now even though the sun is shining and the sky is blue but bring warm clothes Icy, windy up here, but beautiful, and we escaped all the tourist masses. Look at it, it's just us now. The Fimvarduhals Trail. I honestly, every time I say an Icelandic place or name, I hope I pronounce it correctly. I don't know, but I will just keep on pretending that I know how to pronounce it. <laughs> so, the Fimvarduhals lies between the Eyjafjalla Jökull Glacier and between the Mirhals, what was the name again? Mirdals Jökull, <laughs> which is another huge glacier which covers the volcano Katla, which is expected to erupt anytime soon. But then again, what does soon mean? You know, soon is a very vague term. before this is what I imagine fairy tale landscape would look like these rocks and these rivers and the beautiful rough nature and then there's the glacier with the ice and snow in the background and it's just so freaking beautiful but there is one tip the wind is really icy the more up you go I guess the closer you get to the glacier the colder it gets I already feel my ears hurting a little bit so I think next time I would actually bring a hat or something that really pushes down and covers the ears and prevents the wind from blowing into the ears if that makes any sense so this is my tip and now enough ear talk let's go explore some more
that is a very nice PP place. Okay, I'm not gonna film you. <laughs> that is the thing when you are out here and you need to pee, you're gonna expose your bum to icy cold winds and hope your pee doesn't free to your ass. Oh, we just found this cute little place. I honestly, I, any moment I have the feeling a fairy must jump out of the water. It's just so magical. And I know maybe you think I'm over exaggerating, but I'm just blown away by the beauty of this place. And the wind in my face. I mean, look at this. Doesn't this look like a little fairy pool? <sighs> and all the rocks that came tumbling down. Welcome to the best restaurant in town. Yep. We are currently sitting in the best spot. No reservations needed. <laughs> you can just come here, put your popo on the floor and enjoy a beautiful lunch with an amazing view. Wonderful soup. Wonderful, Wonderful soup. Sandwich. Yes, you already, if you have been following the Iceland series, you already know about the magical soup. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to compare with anywhere else. It's the best soup in the whole wide world. Yeah, with the best water in the world. Mm. That is really true. Like the water here in Iceland, truly incroyable. Mm. It's almost a metaphor for life. Mm. You get the most amazing views if you walk up some hills, mm -hmm. struggle along some rocky roads, but in the end, it's worth it and you're going to appreciate it even more. Goodbye! We had an amazing lunch. It was delicious. With an amazing view. And now we're heading back down the mountain. The mountains. It's such a beautiful day. Guys, honestly, you have to come here. Don't just go look at the waterfall. I dare you. So now let's walk back down and I'll meet you when we're downstairs. Downstairs, is that the right term? Can you say downstairs of a mountain? I don't know. But I'll meet you when we got down. As you can see, we are back at the apartment. Actually starting to pack up because tomorrow we need to leave. So this is the situation packing, putting things away, assessing what we need for the trip and what we are not gonna need anymore. It is a bit sad because we both felt so comfortable here and it's just such a homey place and I'm so glad that we came here and stayed here a couple of days instead of just rushing from place to place. This was perfect for the end of our trip because the place is beautiful there are so many things you can see around here and we just felt so peaceful here somehow and just i don't know it, it's just a very nice place Ooh. tomorrow we're gonna go back to Reykjavik we're gonna spend one last day there and then we fly back home so Iceland has come to an end it was two amazing beautiful breathtaking weeks i'm never gonna forget it we had so much fun did Yay. we yes <laughs> and um, i'm just so so grateful that i came here that i had the opportunity to travel to such a beautiful country we have been pretty lucky with the weather 
um, but we also got to experience the fun crazy raining windy thing so I just think everything kind of had its place in this trip and I'm very very grateful it was a lot of fun so now this is the thing tomorrow i'm not gonna film we're gonna spend one last day treating ourselves to good meals good lunch strolling around just enjoying the day and i'm not gonna be filming our last day because i just want to be enjoying it and just be in the moment so this is actually where the iceland series come to an end <gasps> so sad it's come to an end time to say goodbye <laughs> yes guys Argentina <laughs> All that there's left to say is that I really hope that you enjoyed this Iceland series. Um, let me know in the comments down below if there is a favorite video of this whole series. If you have any questions or anything else you want to tell me. I had an amazing time here and I'm happy that I got to bring you along. I'm also very happy that I got to come here with my mom who is freaking awesome. And we had, don't laugh, it's the truth. <laughs> it's the truth. We had a very fun time together. I'm here with you too. Oh, it was amazing. It was amazing, yes, yeah. it really was. So yes, guys, that's it for the Iceland series. Thank you so much for following, follow, following me along on this trip. It was a lot of fun. So if you enjoyed this amazing last video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave a nice comment down below. And I will see you next week with another video, which I don't know what it's going to be, but we'll see. So until then, don't forget to be grateful. Truly, I mean it. Be grateful. Be happy, which is always nice. And be kind. It's very important. Be kind to yourself and others. And yes, I will see you next week. Bye-bye.